Hello beautiful women, I am Ishita Saluja, founder and head stylist at Ishita Saluja Image Consultancy. I style incredible women across the globe who are reinventing themselves and looking for a boost in their confidence. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Isn't it every woman's dream to look and feel like a boss babe? Because that comes with certain freedom and power. When we feel confident, not only we look more confident, but also we feel more in control of ourselves and our destiny. But that comes with certain challenges. It's not easy to become one. We need to be aware of some key rules when we are aiming to look and feel like a boss babe. And in today's video, I'm going to take you through them. A, B, C of becoming a boss babe. Appearance behavior and communication. So in today's video, I will take you through the wardrobe essentials when you are wanting to become a boss babe and the color psychology behind it. I will also teach you how to create the right behavior and the mindset to achieve your goals. We will talk about vision board, habit building, the right mindset when it comes to creating a confident you. And let's face it, when it comes to communication, it only takes four seconds for anybody to judge you about your personality, your trustworthiness, your accountability, and so many other things. So when we talk about the A, B, C, this is going to help you achieve the goal and become the woman that you want to. So let's first talk about the wardrobe essentials to look absolutely confident and create that boss babe impression. Number one, and which is the most important part is a layer especially a blazer when you wear a blazer not only it adds more authority but it also makes you look more powerful number two a crisp white shirt which is without fail the most important part of your wardrobe number three straight trousers to create more structured looks it's imperative that we own things that will help us achieve the look that we are aiming at Number four, close shoes. Remember, whenever you want to look more confident and powerful, close shoes will always come to your rescue. Number five, and the most important, a monochromatic Indian wear outfit. It could be a straight kurta with pants or even a black sari or a red sari, whatever works in your favor. Start building your wardrobe according to your lifestyle and your goals and you will see you are not only able to create the looks that you are aiming for but you are also more confident when you step out or look in the mirror. And once your wardrobe is coming together, we really need to talk about the colors that you are picking up. I am going to give you the example how color can change how you are perceived and it is called color psychology. I'm going to give you an example of three colors that are mostly used in the setup of looking more powerful. Number one, color black. Remember, black is the color of authority and sophistication. Number two, color blue and my personal favorite. It makes sure that you look more dependable and trustworthy. And number three, the color red, which is the color for attraction. Make sure you choose the colors according to what you are aiming for. Have a clear goal and agenda, then choose the right clothes with the right color, which will help you become a complete boss babe. And if you want to understand this in detail, you can also check my YouTube video of how to look more authoritative and I'm attaching the link right here. And now let's talk about another very important aspect of your appearance, which is beyond clothing and it is grooming. It is so imperative that you look absolutely groomed at any given point because your grooming can make or break the look. Make sure whenever you are stepping out, your hair is absolutely neat and crisp. Your nails are done and you are looking absolutely structured. If your grooming goes wrong, your outfit will go wrong. How many times it happens when we see somebody in the right kind of clothing but their nails are dirty or their hair is all over, it doesn't create the lasting impression. Like I said, you do not get a second chance to create that first impression. So go my girl and make sure that your clothes and your grooming are aligned. If your appearance is aligned with your behavior, that is what is going to put you in a different league. And this is what brings me to the second rule. B 
for behavior when i talk about behavior i do not mean how you behave in public but i mean how you behave with yourself behavior is about your everyday life number 1 how you talk to yourself number 2 your mindset number 3 your habits number 4 your everyday activities or smaller habits that will lead to big results and number 5 your visions and goals for your everyday life so let's get started so let's talk about the first aspect which is how do you talk to yourself remember it is the most important component of becoming a boss babe which is your attitude towards yourself remember positive attitude towards yourself equals to high self esteem which will help you make sure that you are looking and feeling confident through and through the day positive mindset remember whatever is happening your mindset is going to not only define your day but also your life so make sure whatever comes your way a project a problem or a happy situation keep your mindset positive and keep your head high and you will see a difference in how you are changing and becoming into a confident woman number 3 and something very very close to my heart your everyday habits remember habits can break or make your life start building smaller habits that will lead to bigger results for me a book called atomic habit by james clear changed the way i was doing my everyday i built habits around my life for myself which made my everyday life and gave me bigger results just in about 6 months for example stacking habits which means creating things one after the other for example if i have to meditate i exactly know when and how let's say when i wake up in the morning the first thing i do is meditate so i stack that habit one after the other and which makes my meditation more easier and more continuous i would highly recommend that you go and read this book called atomic habit and you will see a difference the day you start executing it number 4 your everyday activities make sure you start your day by defining your goals long term and short term when you have your goals clearly written in front of you not only you are able to achieve them easily but you also are accountable to them so make sure every month you set your goals every day you set your goals and at the end of the day or the month tick mark those that you achieved and take the ones that you haven't to the next day or the next month these smaller everyday activities will absolutely help you in becoming a boss babe number 5 and something very close to my heart create a vision board how to create a vision board let me break it down for you write down all the goals that you have on a piece of paper now go on pinterest and find the pictures that resonate with you and your goals and put them together in a collage now make this collage the screen wallpaper of your phone or take a print out or put it on your almira washroom or anywhere that you can keep on seeing it trust me when you have a clear vision on that vision board you will be able to achieve your goals so much faster and in a way which will be so miraculous so go ahead follow these steps and you will see that every day you are becoming the boss babe that you have always wanted to become number 3 the third rule c communication now there are two types of communication verbal or non verbal verbal is how we are speaking and non verbal is when we are communicating without speaking comes through our facial gestures and even our body language remember communication is very important when it comes to relation buildings and when we have the right relations not only we are able to achieve better things in life but we also feel good about ourselves so let's talk about the two aspects verbal and non verbal so first let's talk about verbal verbal is the pitch of your tone how we are communicating and the right kind of tone that is required to communicate the message make sure you practice your tone before important meetings or any kind of important communication with the right kind of practice you will already be aware as to how you want to convey with the right kind of conviction apart from your tone you also need to make sure that the words that you are conveying to your potential partners or even your colleagues that come out absolutely clearly with the right kind of grammar even when out sending out mails it's important you communicate with the right kind of grammar and make sure you double check it 
right kind of communication will put you in a place like nothing else because when you align your behavior communication with your appearance there is nothing that can stop you to become the boss babe now coming to the second aspect of communication which is your body language your body language is the kind of communication which is happening even when you're not talking make sure your body language is always working in your favor one easiest way to understand this is when you're trying to look more authoritative make sure you have more open body language closed body language while talking to your colleague or your partner will not reflect the best about you make sure we are communicating through our body language in the best way that we can more open body language more crisp communication will help you achieve your goals faster you can also check my video on the right kind of body language and i'm also attaching the link of the same here remember there is no one size fit all approach when it comes to becoming a boss babe but it definitely takes hard work dedication and right kind of tools when you are achieving to become one It's a huge undertaking and it won't happen overnight but when you stay consistent and true to yourself you will get there eventually so make sure that you follow these rules and follow the a b c of becoming a boss babe and i promise you you will reach there and also if you have any other questions of how to become one you can hit me up at info@ishitasaluja.com You can also take our self-paced course ABC of becoming a boss babe which is designed in a manner which will help you break these in more simpler manner and help you become a confident self easily and quickly when you execute these rules. Thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more such amazing content. Do not forget to hit the bell icon. This is Ishita Saluja, your style partner, signing off. Remember, style is for everyone and yours is within you.